Pink Hope is Australia's only charity that is focused on ensuring all women are proactive and vigilant with their breast and ovarian health and also to provide a safe haven for high risk women to connect. I started it um, when I was 25, um, when I was recovering from a preventative double mastectomy um, and I carry the BRCA1 gene fault, so the same gene fault that Angelina Jolie carries. I was 22 when I was gene tested. Um, I come from a family with four generations affected um, by cancer. Um, my great grandma was 68, my nan was 44, my mum was 36 and um, I grew up from a very young age you know, uh, knowing about my family history and the risks that that entailed. When I went in for the surgery, I had two young boys. Um, they were four um, and 11 months. So that was an experience, um, recovering from surgery and looking after two young kids. Um, and after my um, surgery, about, oh gosh, 15 months later, I had a beautiful baby girl. I was actually picking up the kids from school and I had two children on each hip and backpacks and I got a call and it was literally, are you in front of a computer? Have you seen Angelina Jolie has your gene fault? And I was like, okay, wow, this is huge. And then they said that she'd had a preventative double mastectomy and I just thought in that moment, one of the most famous women in the world, married to Brad Pitt, lives in the Hollywood Hills, has indirectly endorsed our charity and what we stand for. And that was probably one of the biggest four days of my life. I had about three hours sleep. And my husband and my kids were very understanding. They said, not every day does someone like Angelina Jolie share her story that is very, it was very similar to mine. It was the first time, I guess, that um, any normal mum from the suburbs could relate to Angelina Jolie. But I did, and in that moment, it just changed our charity forever. Within about four weeks, we had a 700% increase in the amount of people that are accessing our resource. Our website nearly crashed. We had plastic surgeons, family cancer clinics. Every, I, even at my house, we had like every single major television station in my tiny cottage on the northern beaches, like a press conference. It was just the most amazing gift that she's given our charity and our cause globally. And it's definitely given us a great platform to launch Bright Pink Lipstick Day for the second year. Well, I met Crystal through a mutual friend and I think, you know, her charity is so important in creating this awareness and I believe it's really important for women to help empower women and so I really wanted to help support in any way that I could. Yeah. We're just absolutely honoured to have her supporting us when she's in Australia and she's just a good chick and is, <laughs> has great fashion sense and yeah, we're, we're very lucky to have her involved in Pink Coke. So thanks, Thank you. Thank you very much.